Hey Camp Island, my name is Noah Keeter. I am 19 years old and I am applying for the summer staff position at the overnight camp for the 2021 summer. Um, I was told I needed to make a video about why I wanted to work at Camp Island and I wanted to immediately jump on this because I am thinking of a million different reasons right now why I've always, always, always wanted to work at Camp Island. Um, but I'll condense it to a few points for you guys um, just because I, uh, I don't want to keep you guys here for too long. Um, so for starters, I've always wanted to work at Camp Island um, ever since like the seventh grade. I think it's, yeah, it's been like, it's been like seven or eight years um, since, I've, since I've been to Camp Island. Um, uh, I started going, like I said, when I was in seventh grade and it was just like, I literally got in the car <laughs> um, after my very, very first week at camp. And I said, I want to be a staff member here. Like I want to be a counselor here. I want to be able to influence um, I want to be in the outdoors. Um, I just want to be here. Like I've always, uh, I've just, I've, I've always had this desire to uh, work at overnight camp. Um, so that's like very briefly <laughs> the first point. Um, another reason why I've always wanted to work at camp uh, is just because as I am um, taking more college classes, like I'm a business major, I'm learning about uh, management and having to run a business uh, and what that looks like. And I go to a private school as well. So I learn from a Christian worldview um, how you accomplish that and how you can evangelize through that. And I, I, I made a pact to myself that whenever I get my job, I want to be in a position of influence and leadership because I want to influence and evangelize through that. So that has always been um, my goal. And I really feel like I can do that through Camp Island. I mean, what better way to do that than Camp Island? Um, so that is really the big reason why is that I've always wanted to um, use my job as a mode of evangelism and Camp Island can do that for me. Um, another reason why is also that I'm, I'm quite experienced in, in the world of Camp Island. Uh, for the past two summers, um, I have been working at day camp, which has really prepared me, um, I think for overnight. Uh, it's prepared me to, um, to have this kind of responsibility and to still evangelize and to be able to articulate the gospel on many different levels, right? I'm working with like four-year-olds, uh, five-year-old, six-year-old, seven, all the way up to 11 years old. So I need to know how to be able to do that. And so I have this wide range that I have learned um, how to speak to kids on those kinds of issues. Uh, and also uh, just like the last reason I just want to tell you guys why I want to work here because I'm running out of time <laughs> um, is that I want to work here because um, like camp is just my passion. Like I live in Huntsville, Alabama, and I went out of my way for the past two years to find a host home, to find people I can stay with and live with um, and live, you know, like going into my senior year of high school, I was living on my own in Georgia for, for two months, uh, working at Camp Island, just cause I love you guys so much. Um, my college is like six hours away from overnight. And yet I have gone out of my way. I've, I've really, really tried to get there and help for volunteering. Um, so that is just, <laughs> um, like, yeah, I, it's, it's just my passion. Like Camp Island is just everything that I have always loved. Um, I'm never bored of it. I am always excited about it. Um, I love my, I love the relationships that I've built uh, with my fellow um, staff members from these past two years. Um, and I hope I get to do that more. Um, so thank you guys so much. I'm applying for, you know, counselor, memory maker, a team. I've been in the system uh, long enough. Michael Watanabe can attest to that. Um, <laughs> hi, Michael, if you're watching. <laughs> um, and uh, yeah, I, yeah, I'm, I, I just hope you guys take this, um, take this in good spirits, and uh, hopefully I'll get a call from you guys later. So, love you guys. Take care.